In this video, you're going to learn about the three types of home sellers. Two of them you must avoid if you want to get the best deal on your home purchase. Hi, my name is Betty Gonzalez. I'm a real estate agent with the XP Realty in Miami. And in this video, I'm going to talk about the three types of home sellers that you'll encounter when buying a house. Now, two of these sellers are ones that you definitely want to avoid if you want to get the best deal on your next purchase. So stick around and I'll tell you who they are and what to do about it. Welcome to Dorado Homes by Betty Gonzalez, where you learn everything you need to know about living in South Florida, especially here in Doral. Something that most buyers do not know is that regardless of the market conditions, there are only three types of home sellers that they may encounter. The first type of seller is the low motivation seller. This seller may have some interest in selling their home, but they are not as eager as motivated sellers and will not typically push aggressively to find a buyer. Instead, they will simply prefer someone wanting to buy their house who happens to come across their property online or through other means. Low motivation sellers usually will not discount the value of their home significantly and will be much less likely to make any repairs unless absolutely necessary for legal reasons. Instead, these type of sellers are looking for buyers who will accept any existing condition on the property or as you might know it as is condition. The second type of seller is the future seller. This type of seller is mainly testing the market by casually offering the home for sale in order to get an idea of what kind of offers they could receive from potential buyers. But despite their efforts, these individuals are not actually interested in selling their home at this time and they do not expect to receive any legitimate offers anytime soon. Future sellers typically do not put much effort into marketing their property or even making necessary repairs. Instead, they wait until the right offer comes along and then consider it if it meets certain criteria such as price and terms offered by the buyer. If you're finding value in this video, do me a huge favor and hit the like button so others on YouTube can benefit from this video as well. Thank you. The third type of seller and the seller that you will want is the motivated seller. These sellers are actively seeking to sell their homes and are willing to negotiate on price in order to attract potential buyers. They may also be willing to invest time, money, and resources into making necessary repairs or improvements in order to make their home more attractive or sellable. Overall, understanding which type of seller you're dealing with can help both buyers and sellers alike to get the best overall outcome out of the real estate transactions. Knowing what motivates each party involved can give buyers insight into how flexible a particular seller may be when negotiating a final purchase price while helping guide future home sellers on how to best market their property when they finally decide it is time to move forward on the sale. Watch this next video next, popping up on the screen, See you inside that video. And remember, my name is Betty Gonzalez, serving the military community of South Florida, from serving our country to serving you.